If you're studying for the GRE, this next tip is really crucial for you. Let's take a look at my computer as I show you the actual calculator that's available to you on the test and why it pretty much is the worst. All right, <clears throat> so we're gonna take a look at the actual calculator that you're going to see on the test. And it's up here, this little calc button. This is the calculator that you have available to you. And uh, you can see it has very basic functions. There is a square root function here, um, and then your standard arithmetic functions. And that's pretty much it. So when you're trying to do something like eight cubed, it's going to take a little bit of time because you have to do eight times eight times eight. And that's why, because this calculator is literally so crappy, you definitely want to take the time to memorize or get really good at mental math. I mean, any calculation that you can do quickly is going to be so useful in saving you time. Now, certain things you're certainly going to come in and use the calculator for, but you want to save that for when you really have to because you don't want to have to use this and have that take so much time to put in a number like 0 0.387387387 387 387 to use the, the numbers right here. That's going to take quite a while and it will be much faster if you can do some of that in your head.